Hey y'all, it's Jay, and I'm coming to you today to do the Tall Girl Tag. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so in this tag, there are 16 questions. And I have the questions written down on this sheet of paper right here. So we just gonna go ahead and jump up in. I might have to take my glasses off, you know. Side note, I got them from City Trends if you're wondering. No prescription, you know. Your girl got 20 20. She just trying to be cute right now, you feel me? First question is, what is your name, age, location, and height? So, I am Jandra, or J, as you may know. You can put shameless plug right here. You can follow me on IG at Jandra Tanise, Twitter at Jandra Tanise, Facebook at Jandra T. Clark, and YouTube at Jandra Tanise. Um, I am 22 years old. I've been 22 for about... I'll say about 35, 36 days. My birthday is December 11. I know they ain't asked for that, but I'm just going to throw that out there. Um, I am, well, I live in Memphis, Tennessee, but I go to school in Clarksville, Tennessee. So, yeah. And what's the next question? Oh, my height. I'm 5'9-ish. Well, not ish. I don't know if I'm exactly 5'9 or a little above 5'9, but I don't like doctors. So, the last time I went, they told me I was 5'9. Um. Question number two is, were you always tall and how did it feel? So, yes, I've always been tall. I've always been like the tallest female in my classes, starting in like elementary school. And I mean, I've just now come to accept the fact that it's not going to change. So I can say that it felt like a little lonely at the top. You know, it's lonely at the top. So I have to say that. So question number three is, are your parents tall? Yes, my whole family is tall. But my mother is 5'11 and my father is 6'3. Fourth question, are your siblings tall? So my little sister, she just turned 21. She is 5'8. My other little sister, she is 14. She is 5'6" ish five seven um and my little baby sister she won i don't know how tall she is so five is what is the meanest thing that you've been called because of your height so i would say the meanest thing and i know some people probably think it's crazy i know the little blue avatar thing in the avatar movie i've never seen the avatar movie but i seen the commercials and somebody called me an avatar and i didn't think that was cute and i didn't think that that was funny so that hurt my little spirit so an avatar I mean, they cute now because, you know, she cute. So, if anything she compared to going to be cute. So, question number six is, what is the best comment that you got because of your height or compliment or whatnot? A lot of people say, oh, I wish I was your height. Oh, I love your legs. Oh, you should be a model. Oh, you should do this. Oh, you should do that. Uh, oh, another main comment. Oh, another main comment tracking back was somebody asked me they was like so do you play basketball I was like um no so they said you just a waste of height I didn't ask to be like this so you gonna tell me I'm just wasting my life because I'm not a basketball player really okay we're not even gonna get on that but we're gonna go to question eight question eight is what is your shoe size well, you know, she loves her shoes, and my shoe size is anywhere from a eight and a half-ish to a nine. Yeah, most of my shoes are nines, though, and I have a few that are eight and a half, and I have, a, like, I think I have one or two pairs that are ten because my mom like to wear my shoes, but that's a different story for a different day. Uh, nine, do you have any dating rules, and if so, what are they? Okay, as far as height, my rule, my preference, don't judge me. I would prefer to have a man that is 6'2 and up because I like to wear heels. For example, I told y'all I'm 5'9", so this, this right here, I need somebody, you know, that's at least going to be around about the same height. I don't want to have to look down at my man, y'all know what I'm saying. Even if I don't have heels on, I still don't want to look down at him. Like, I just want to be great. Like, is that a problem? 
I want to be, look, be able to look her, or even if I don't be able to tilt my head, be able to, you know, do the eyes like this. Like, yeah, I don't want to be doing this. I, no, no, that's the only one I have. I know I'm rambling, but I'm going to go to the next one. Um, 10, do you love or hate your height? Simple yes or no. I guess they trying to say, you know, don't be rambling about it. But I would say now, this day, yes, I love my height. Question 11, are you ashamed to embrace your height? Uh, right now, this day, I would say that, well, I can't completely say I'm not ashamed because I still have my days. So, for the most part, I would say I'm not ashamed to embrace my height. Um, question 12 is, do you ever wish you were shorter? Back in the day, every day I used to pray and be like, God, why I got to be so tall? I mean, I know I'm great and you made me to be like spectacular and extraordinary and you want me to be closer to you, but I just want to relate to the people. Can I just get knocked down too? Not just because I just want to relate to the people, but I get it be like that. So question 13 is... What are some things that you used to do to make yourself seem shorter? In pictures, I would bend my knees in pictures. In like regular pictures, like sitting down type pictures, you do this. Like that. Um, when everybody else is wearing heels, I wear flats. Um, well, I, not now, you know. If everybody wearing flats, I still wear heels. Like, baby, you gonna see me, you know. Um, what else? What are some other stuff that I used to do? Uh, I don't know. It's a lot. Oh, the little leaning on one leg thing. Like, you know, when you standing up straight, you stand like this. But when you lean to the side, you go down a little bit. I used to lean a lot. That's probably why my knees hurting right now. But, you know, I used to lean. <laughs> Question 14 is, when you see a fellow tall girl, how do you feel? Or what are some thoughts that go to your mind? I be like, Girl, look at her. Like, I be on Instagram, y'all, and I see some of these tall girls or models or whatnot that's, like, six, three plus, and they have, like, their little lingerie or swimsuits or whatever on, and legs be popping. I be like, girl, like, come on now. Come through, legs. I see y'all. Y'all popping. Like, we popping, y'all. That's all I got to say. That's how I feel. That's the thoughts that run through my head. Like, oh, I wonder where she got her stuff from. Like, hey, y'all, so I was in a rush to answer that question. So that wasn't question 14. That was question 15. So question 14 was, are you the tallest out of your friends? So out of my friend group, I would say I'm not the tallest out of my friend group. I have, like, one or two other friends that are um the same height or taller than me. So... And even when I'm not hanging with the ones that are the same height and taller than me, I really don't feel bad in my friend group because, like, it's a comfort zone. Like, you're comfortable with the people that you're around. So, the last question, question 16 is, how do you feel or how is it looking for pants and shoes and stuff like that? So, like I told y'all, I wear an eight and a half, nine in shoes, so I really don't have too much of a problem looking for shoes. But the pants situation, that's a different story, baby. I just want some skinny jeans that come, uh, like, to my ankles. That's all I want. But I have yet to find them. But most of the time, I shop in, like, thrift stores and stuff like that because, you know, your girl is real thrifty. And I don't like to spend that much money, especially on clothes, because I like clothes. So I know that I have a problem. So I go in stores where I feel like I can get more for my money. And I just, I'm tired of rolling the ends of my pants up to make them, like, slick capris. Ankles be cold, ashy sometimes, can't even hide them. Like, so if y'all have any advice on where I can get some pants, you know, at a decent price, you know, at a decent length, let your girl know, hit your girl up. But I'm so excited. I actually finished this video in less than 10 minutes. But if it's anything else y'all want me to talk about, anything else y'all want to hear, please let me know. I gave y'all all the links to all my social media accounts. I will put them in the description box also. So, yeah, that's it for today. Okay, y'all, so it's a little side note. This is Beauty Supply Store hair. I paid $20 for this hair. It is Peruvian Bundle Wave. So if y'all want me to do a review on it, just let me know, and I will. But I'm gone for real now. Bye.